Why, good morning everyone. How are you doing this morning? Uh, whatsoever, like, y'all know I always like to give y'all a little update here. Because the shit is so motherfucking bipolar. But then again, you know, we know, everybody know we go through the transition, so we go through the transition, it is what it is. So, and it could be all over the place. Um, yesterday we had mad rain. They said it's supposed to be 70 degrees. It feels okay, like, you know. You see, I don't have no scarf on my neck or nothing like that. It's all good. Anyway, I hope everybody is feeling well, feeling good. Had a great weekend. Getting ready for this work week. If you're just now getting off work, that you relax. Snugged up in your bed and all that good shit. So then I want to talk about, and somebody asked me, like, about kissing. Uh, kissing. You know, I remember the first time I kissed somebody. I think I was in the sixth grade when you actually, where it was like mouth to mouth contact. Well, I'm, you know what I'm saying? Like inside, like just ah, that type of shit. It was the most disgusting thing I think I had ever motherfucking experienced. I was like, ugh, I spat all day, just put, 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 put. I was just spitting, like, put, put. It was disgusting. Disgusting. But I don't remember when it actually got better. No, yes, I do. I used to like to kiss this boy when I was in the eighth grade. Uh -huh. Woo! I used to kiss, 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 and kiss and kiss and kiss until our motherfucking lips, like, you know, my mouth and jaws and shit was fucking sore. Like, this shit was crazy. I know he had blue balls like a motherfucker. But back then, I ain't know nothing about that shit. But he pressed me for no pussy or nothing, so that was nice. So, but, um, the, to master like kissing, it's just a trial and error. It's the same thing with my fucking sex. But, I, but definitely kissing. Like, you gonna, you have to try this one, try that one. Then you find somebody that you link up with, that you have a strong sexual chemistry with, and y'all kiss, like, it's just, this meant magnetic. It's just automatic. Like you just become like a born motherfucking professional. You understand what I'm saying? And then you know what you kind of like and what you don't like. Like some people are like, like who mouth produces a lot of saliva. Now if you like that type of shit, then that's what you like. But if not, then you know, you don't. But it, it is, like it's just all about you finding somebody who you who you attracted to and they're attracted to you and you two like kiss and you just become good at it. And then as you get, you know, people who you don't, like, I don't know, I never, and as an adult, I think about myself, there's never been nobody that I ever got with that I didn't sexually and I didn't like the way we kiss because the sexual chemistry was too strong. You understand what I'm saying? Then I don't like to pass my pussy out. Like I told y'all before, to motherfuckers like that. I just don't do that. You understand what I'm saying? But it is just all about you. I don't know. Just the chemistry that you have with somebody sexually. And you just instantly become like a master at the way that you like to kiss. And whomever you have that sexual energy with, like this, the kissing is just gonna be, it's gonna be like going to auto drive. Like it's just like this shit is right. This is going down, boom, and there it is. So yeah. So kiss, 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 kiss. Kissing is great. I love kissing, especially like before you like the foreplay, all the kissing that you do. Uh, it makes it the sex so much much sweeter when he climb in between and penetrate your pussy and shit. Be like, ah, yes, you know what I mean? But anyway, y'all have a great day. Y'all know I'm here every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 8 a.m. and talking that real sex stuff with your girl real. You know how a service called seductive art, surround around sexuality, and see visual stimulation. We have real sex talk. Uh, let me put on our heels not teaching me erotic and sensual dance. I also have written my first book. It's called Quickie. It's seven short erotic stories. 
please get that, get that. It's only a dollar ninety-nine. It's only an ebook form, so you check your favorite ebook retailer and support black independent motherfucking artists out here trying to make shit happen. You feel me? Please like, share, subscribe. Definitely subscribe. Let me tell y'all something. I cannot go live because I need like a thousand motherfucking followers. Can y'all just click, click the subscribe goddamn button? I'd appreciate that so kindly. Y'all have a great day and I'll see y'all here tomorrow. And later.